Right, well, dozens of Tesla workers in Buffalo, New York, were fired on Wednesday, a day after they announced plans to move to form a union. That's according to a complaint filed to the National Labor Relations Board. Senior tech reporter Ali Garfinkel is here with more. Hey, Ali. Hi, Rochelle. So this would be Tesla's first U.S. union that these workers are gunning for. And at 7 p.m. last night, a group of them came up, came upon emails that said they were fired. Now, they've already filed complaints with the NLRB. And it's important to say that these workers are actually represented by Workers United, the union that has facilitated Starbucks's very successful union push. Now, unions aren't new for Tesla at all. In fact, the company has a pretty notable anti-union record that we've seen so far. We only need to go back to 2017, for instance, when Tesla fired California union activist Richard Ortiz. That termination was later ruled to be a legal retaliation. That, com that, that case is actually an appeal right now. We also need to go back to December to 2021. Musk got in legal trouble for a two-year-old tweet that was suggesting that employees who unionize would lose stock options. That tweet as of this morning is still up. And now, December 2022. My sense of time isn't great, but that's just about two months ago from what I gather. And and the NL, there was an NLRB complaint out of a Tesla location in Orlando, Florida, saying that employees were being dissuaded from discussing pay and working conditions. So this is a this is something from Tesla we've seen before. I reached out to them for comment, but received an email bounce back, which is not surprising given that Elon Musk, I believe, fired the Tesla PR team in 2020. Well, that would that would explain it indeed. Ali Garfinkel, thank you so much for getting us up to speed on that Tesla story.